Hi guys, a uh, quick video. Um, someone named an enemy mirror on the Discord, uh, Planetfall Discord, asked if someone could test how quickly we could do uh, solo hero camp clear with a syndicate synth. Um, I'll go more into the build after this. All you need to know right now is I have this hero. So level two um, starts with an old jetpack from Klepto, and then I bum rushed the Guardian Damon Shell and the uh, Targeting Damon Shell level one synth mods. I got an early Ego Rifle, so I don't have the Hasher SMG for this, and I've got the Arc Grenade from the start. I went uh, Vitality and Deadeye for my level one up or my level 2 upgrade, because I want to save 1 XP point so I can get Agile Overwatch after this, so he really has pretty much nothing else other than Martial Tradition, so if I get a kill, he goes again. Uh, that should be everything you need to know for that, and then these guys, there we are. Um, we've got two hidden, sorry, a hidden... What are you? Not a hidden. A runner, an indentured, a runner, a runner, sorry I can't click, a trencher, and a... this is not letting me click on it. A foreman. Um, it's a foreman. He buffs people. The only other thing to note is everyone but the runners, if they cross this, is going to take damage, so I try to use that to my advantage and split the party. Uh, there's a lot of RNG in this, but I think it shows that there's potential. Let's just stop talking about things and get to it, shall we? So to be clear, I'm not the best at these kinds of tactics. I uh, played a lot of Long War back in the day, so I'm not terrible either. But uh, as you saw there, I got a little unlucky and he hit me with a mobilize, which sucks because it disables the jetpack. And uh, that was my overwatch going off as I just creeped up. So I'm about to blast him and you'll see me get to go again because, hey, I've got martial tradition. And that should be basically everything you need for the rest of this fight. Enemy destroyed. Take some shots. Half cover plus Damon Shell. Got unlucky there, that could have killed. So now he gets the full heal. So jetpack out. That was very lucky, I got a crit, and then I got another crit. So I don't know if this would have been possible without that back-to-back -back crits. I hadn't been exactly lucky at the start, but suddenly it was all in one spurt. Uh, took out two big enemies. And then from here it's mostly clean up, just playing safe. Another crit really helps, because he kept staggering me. I hate Devar. Walks up and punches me in the face. I take the punch walking away. Another stagger. Jet back out. Flank shot for the kill. Destroyed. So yeah, that's the camp clear. The syndicate rules supreme. Thank you for telling me. Um, I don't know. There was a lot of luck involved in that. I'm not sure how much of that is modified by the fact that I was getting flanks and whatnot. Uh, I know it definitely helps your chances, so it might just be that with all the mods that I've got, that's actually reasonable and legit. Um, as you can see, cleared five units with one hero. I did take a lot of damage. Um, but there's something to this. Because again, this is a level two hero. I don't think normally you would do this until level three. I need to do some testing with uh, other things, like Klepto RNG versus going Decadent, which is what the original build suggested. Um, just to show it off real quick, cool, 68 Merc, or 68 whatever. I started with, uh, I didn't start with Data Vaults either because I didn't want to screw with the RNG too much. Um, I took Energy, which I just used to rush a Settler over here. I cleared basically two camps. Oh, um, did I have two or three fights before this? I either had two or three fights before this. I went straight for this turn one, which was a uh, Autonom... What was it? Two monitors, Golem, and a Justicar. Won that fight, no losses. Then went over here, took another fight, no losses. Oh yeah, I had three fights. There were two-ish over here somewhere. Um, so that's why my hero is level two, not level three. And as you'll notice, he's just now gotten to level three, so I've got a boatload of skill points. 
Um, so I'll grab... Oh, actually, he went straight to level 4. Oh, God. Yeah, I was going to say, that seems high. Uh, I don't know. I'd probably go at least Keen Sight and uh, Watchmen. And then... I don't know. Maybe this is actually where you go escape module. I've been kind of down on it. Maybe you go disrupting hack. I don't know. Um, I can at least confirm that. I've got a save right before this so I can test again. Uh, there's the army I was wandering around with. Um, anything else? I think you've seen most of it. Oh yeah, let's just go to the tech tree real quick. So just to show, yep, nothing here. Working on exploit weakness next because the original idea was go synth then go exploit weakness and uh, use these three mods, which is why you start with Decadent instead. Uh, that would have been one turn later and I would have been level three, which is why I think the build has legs, because while I got very lucky, you'd normally be a turn later and significantly more powerful due to both of those things. Although then again, Jetpack is really, really freaking good. And then over here, I just rushed Frontier Facilities. So that's the build. This is exciting. Uh, that'll be it.